guys, I wanted to share with you the items that I picked up at my local Mac store the other day. Now, I went to my Mac store with every intention of purchasing the Mac Viva Glam Gaga 2 lipstick and lip gloss. Um, however, you'll just have to watch the rest of this video to find out what happened and so I am going to be showing you everything that I purchased that day and this is just strictly a lipstick purchase so I hope you enjoy please comment below if you have any questions and I thank you guys for stopping by so Viva Glam Gaga 2 lipstick I went there and you know what swatched on my hand put up next to um, my skin tone and everything, it just did not look pretty, guys. I mean, um, I was hoping that I was gonna love it um, because I love my Gaga number no. one lipstick. Like, I love that. I even have um, the gloss. In fact, I have the gloss right here. So, um, what I ended up doing instead of purchasing the gloss and lipstick from Gaga 2 is I bought me a backup of the original Gaga lipstick. I know, that doesn't really sound very eventful, but um, if you have never seen the Viva Glam Gaga lipstick, the original, well, here it is. <laughs> so this is the original one, and it's just a very pretty like baby doll pink. And I bought me this as a backup. As I said, I have owned it before. Just looks like that. It goes on um, kind of sheer. You have to kind of build it up a little bit. It is a, is it a, is it a luster? Yes, it's a lobster, a lobster. It's a lobster lipstick. Just joking. It's a luster. And um, so it has a beautiful like sheen to it. It has a wet look as well. It's not a matte lipstick. And then this was the lip gloss that I had purchased a while ago which was the Lady Gaga original lip gloss and I haven't used it much so I didn't um, buy a backup but swatched it's just right there next to the lipstick so that's the gloss on the bottom, lipstick on the top. Now if you were able to um, really enjoy Gaga 2 then kudos to you because I was really wanting to purchase it because it's a nude lip but you know as I mentioned it just looked horrible on me. It almost looked muddy and um, it just wasn't flattering at all so you know I have other nude lipsticks in my collection most of them are actually drugstore like um, the Airy Fairy from Remmel and there's also like a Revlon nude color that I really like so I just figured you know for the price of $14.50 and me to buy it and I knew I wasn't really gonna reach for it um, I figured to still at least support um, the AIDS you know, charity that they um, donate all the proceeds of this to. I just bought me another Gaga. So, yeah, that's my thoughts on that. I would like to also make mention that um, who did that really awesome video? Attitude of the City. I'm going to put her link below. Um, she is phenomenal when it comes to just offering very helpful information. And the video that she posted about the Gaga 2 lipstick, she went all out, ladies. I mean, she went into her collection. She grabbed other MAC colors. Um, she also grabbed, uh, you know, other brand name colors as well as drugstore colors. And she just, like, swatched, like, nobody's business. I mean, girl was just swatching, swatching for days. And it was really helpful because you were able to kind of watch that video and kind of listen to her explain if you know if Gaga 2 is a little bit too um, you know brown on you you could go with this color you know this is a little bit more pink this is a little bit more nude and so it's a really helpful video if you are in the market for something like that lipstick then please definitely go check her channel out um, support her because she is your only benefit from watching her videos she is extremely extremely helpful so thank you so much for that video girl and let me show you guys everything else that I got as well so I got an amplified cream lipstick and it is in girl about town let me show you the box because I think that my camera will focus a little better on that girl about town it looks like this in the tube. It's kind of almost similar to that spellbound fuchsia color that I'm doing the giveaway for. Um, 
And let me swatch it for you as well. This was a color I did not have in my collection. And it's just, once again, one of those like really bright fuchsia colors that I love. You guys are starting to realize, you know, that I gravitate towards items like this. Another amplified that I got, so pretty. The color is in Up the Amp. There we go. And it looks like this. It's more or less like a purple color. And I wore this the other day. It was really like different from anything that I've really worn before. It is definitely um, a more berry infused purple. But I really did like that a lot. I really enjoy the amplified lipsticks. I don't know. They're just... They're very intense, and I like intense lip colors, so that's probably why I'm attracted to them. This next one is in the color Please Me. Okay, that's the name right there. And it looks like this, and it's almost like a nude, a nude-inspired pink. And swatched on the top right here. It's a very natural, easy to um, wear, you know, not something that's like overbearing. So if you're doing like a very intense eyelid, that might be a great option. And then this next one is in pink plaid. Okay, and it looks like this in the container. And it's another nude inspired pink. And I'll swatch it on the bottom here. That is so pretty. In fact, um, somebody just messaged on that giveaway video for the, the CoverGirl lipstick in, in Spellbound. I'm having a giveaway for this. Somebody messaged me that they love Max Pink Plaid. So when I saw that, I was like, oh, yay, I have Pink Plaid. I just had bought this stuff like, you know, a few days back. So I was like, perfect. I get to try your favorite lipstick color out. So... I'm really excited to start wearing that on the lips because I haven't I haven't worn that one yet. And now this next one is a satin lipstick and it is in the color Brave. And I think that this is actually a very popular color with a lot of people and I am um, one of the last to try it. And this was kind of the alternative um, to that, you know, Gaga lipstick because it was a nude but it wasn't as brown on me. It pulled a lot more pink. I'll swatch it for you here. Just really pretty for a nude lip. And then, I was really surprised that they had this. And I don't know if you guys remember, but I didn't pick up any of the lipsticks from the MAC Wonder Woman when I did that haul video. Um, but now I have one. It's not Spitfire. It's actually... Um, how do you say this? I hear everybody say it, but I'm still horrible at saying it. Is it Marquise D... My case D, I, I believe is how you say it. Anyhow, it is a luster lipstick. And to tell you the truth, um, Attitude of the City, she she showed this in during that video. And although I've seen other people show this lipstick, for some reason, when I watched her video, I was like, oh, I really want that color. And so I was totally surprised that my local MAC had one left. So I snagged her up, and she is beautiful. I mean, I, I feel so lucky because I totally passed, I passed up all the lip products for Wonder Woman. So to be able to score um, this really nice color, I was super stoked. So I'll just swatch it for you here. Hi, Mom. Hi, Buns. I all my pancakes. Good job. Little honey buns is here, guys. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Buns. Love you. Okay, so it's just that color right there at the top. Um, super stoked that I got Bye. that. You don't see nobody on my camera. I know I'm talking to people that are out there in the world. All our friends. I want to. Okay, you know what, guys? This is the last watch because my baby girl wants me. So I gotta go. But I got one lip pencil and it's in the color cherry. And it is a red. You wanna get up in here, don't you, boo? And it looks like that. So anyhow, we're gonna go. Yeah? Pow, yeah? Where are we going? We're gonna go say goodbye to my friends. And what we going to do? I don't know. Something fun. What? You wanted to be over here. Yeah. Yeah, you did. So, anyway, guys. um, Sorry 
if the lighting is awkward or anything. I'm trying to figure it all out, but yeah, just let me know how this is working out on your end as far as being able to view Mama, it. Yeah. This is not Mama. I know this is a new one. Now it's mine. It looks different than all the black colored ones. Yeah. Let me see, Mama. Yeah. Pretty. Pretty. <laughs> so anyhow guys thank you so much for stopping by I hope that those um, swatches were helpful Mama, that's yeah. your friend. those are my friends watching yeah and that's us too and that's us too alright guys so talk to you next time take care bye, bye. <laughs> that's my friend